Hello everyone, are you ready for another adventure? It's me, Wookie, and I'm here with Dreamlight Valley, Disney's Dreamlight Valley, a game that is Animal Crossing with, uh, <laughs> the last name of Stardew Valley. Ooh, let me put this a little bit lower. Uh, and Disney stuff. Uh, it's in early access, because I have Game Pass, I was able to get it, so I'm playing it. Just for a little bit. Uh, I've been messing around with it just a little bit, as you can see here at the beginning as it opens up. Um, this is literally just... It's really sh oh, borderline shameless how this starts off like Stardew Valley and is Animal Crossing <laughs> with Disney characters. Here's my character. You can see right here. Her name is Wookie. Uh, a valid form of Wookie, obviously. Uh, and I'm currently on a mission with Scrooge McDuck here to, I think, what the hell does he want? He wants me to find some soft wood because I need to support him. But there you go. As you can see here. It's literally built based on the time of day, so when I played this late at night, I waited till the morning because they all have their own specific routines that they go on and stuff like that. Um, and yeah, this is the game so far. I think this is neat, and it might just be because I'm a big Disney fan. If you don't know, huge fan of Disney. There was a brief moment in time where I would constantly go to Disneyland with my family. Uh, almost, it was almost once a month. It was a fun-ass time, too. So there you go. Pick up this axe. Bam! Smack him around. I think these are permanent. These are always around. But you kind of build your stuff here. There's a... A daytime... Not daytime. There's a stamina meter here. Let me see over here. So yeah, basically what happened is everyone got hit with the I forgetty beam. And they can't remember anything because of the forgetting. This is my house, by the way. Let me pick this up. Look. This is my sweet ass house. <clears throat> As you can see here, I've kept the decor looking shitty because it reminded me of the haunted mansion. <laughs> so I'm keeping it that way for the time being. This is my arcade machine that I bought. I tried to go into Scrooge's shop to see if I could find a bed. He did not sell me a bed, but he was willing to sell me a arcade machine. But yeah, there's Scrooge. So you go around here, you kind of play around and you kind of just do stuff. You can see here, there's stuff to harvest. Oops. Go here, pick that up. So I can continue making cooking and stuff. Oh, I, pick, I put the cabbage there. Whatever, it's fine. I'm just going to plant a bunch of carrots. Yeah, I don't eat this much carrots in real life, but I will gladly make carrots for my character. Anyway, there we go. Water it up. So this is the part of the game where I said, like, it's not just the specific last name of Stardew Valley. This is the part, to me, that feels like Stardew. But yeah, oh my inventory's full. Uh, let me let me go back and okay, let me go back in here. You can also make friends with these animals. Hey, hello, squirrel. Would you like an apple, friend? Of course you would. And then you rank up your friendship with the animals. And they gave me something. Thank you, sir. So you go in here. You can also col there's a whole bunch of Disney stuff, including Pixar, which Pixar is technically. I mean, it's at this point it is. Uh, ah, what the hell? Okay, there we go. Nope. Ah, oh, no, I can't. Okay, okay. Let me drop stuff off again. Okay, let's go in here. Open up my storage and put... Yeah, there you go. Go in there, buddy. I don't really need you right now. I got some bananas. I got some cookies. Got some driftwood. There we go. There we go. And I got some rocks. Okay, there we go. Uh, so yeah, you can cook stuff, I think. There we go. Make a delicious fruit salad. You get rep uh, recipes from Remy. Apparently Mickey just kind of put them all over the place. So that's why they're all over the place. Because Mickey uh, is big friends with Remy. Because one of them is a mouse and the other one's a rat. So obviously they hang out and they're cool and stuff. But anyway, what was I doing? Oh yeah, here we go. Let me pick up these damn cabbages. Oh, I'm planting so many fucking carrots. There's no, no one person needs this many carrots. No one needs this many carrots! <laughs> Except for maybe Bugs Bunny. There we go. So yeah, we can go in here. We can go say hi to Mickey for a bit. So here's... My, let me see if it plays. I think, yeah, so a lot of the charm of this game is going to be dependent on how much you like Disney stuff. And I really like it, so... Like, specifically when you're in Mickey's house, it plays the Mickey Mouse uh, theme. M-I-C-K-E-Y-Y, Mickey Mouse. 
But it plays like a little hey teeny there. version of it, but... So, uh, you can hang out with dudes. I don't want to hang out with Mickey right now, so I'm just gonna so peace out now. later, Mickey. I wonder if Scrooge's shop has a new place. I don't know when it would specifically restock, but oh, let me pick some stuff up. I need to pick up driftwood for Scrooge anyway. So yeah, that's the other thing that's different compared to Animal Crossing. What are you doing, Goofy? <laughs> what are you trying to pick a fight? If I need any from the stall, come see me. So yeah, he works How's the stall. Howdy, pal. <laughs> you can hang out with him, go fishing. We're not. Maybe we'll do that a little bit later. But you can definitely go fishing. Ooh, shiny. Oh wait, sorry. If there's anything weird looking, it's because my controller is bad. I need to get a new controller. There we go. You can pick stuff up, and there we go. I found some kind of night shard. Cool. Go inside Scrooge's shop. <clears throat> Scrooge is also. You can see all the stuff uh, Scrooge sells in here. Some of it, very like for example, this overall piece, 160. If you want to get this fucking nightstand from the Little Mermaid, three thousand five hundred and twenty dollars. <laughs> this coffee machine, 184. This tiny ship bottle, 544. The spindle, the the computer. This throne costs less than this fucking Little Mermaid chair. <laughs> Oh, and there's also a Beauty and the Beast set. Very nice. A teacup set with Mrs. Potts and Chip over there. Uh, I don't know where this dress is from. Who will tell me? Okay, it is Beauty and the Beast. I mean, it is, you know. No. Oh, Scrooge is so sad when you don't buy anything. What is this? I think this is from the Monster Inc. Yeah. 4000 Are you shitting me with your prices right now, Scrooge? I wanted to get this. It's a fairly vanilla piece here, but this shit costs a lot of money. <laughs> I don't have that kind of dough on me right now. You can buy a damn for the fucking Pirates of the Caribbean ad. <laughs> Ten thousand, Scrooge. What are you doing, my dude? It's too much. So yeah, let me go talk to Scrooge. Brilliant. Now that you gather the wood, we can craft the signs. Craft the sign. So yeah, it kind of puts you through a tutorial, which is something that's not inherent to Animal Crossing at all. So it's going to depend. I guess if you've always been someone who's like, I like the idea of Animal Crossing, but um, I there's, there's no direction, then I guess this is kind of perfect for you. I've always felt like the charm of Animal Crossing is that there's nothing that you that doesn't tell you what to do and you just kind of do stuff. Uh, oh, I can get. I gotta craft various signs. Okay, I can do that. Uh, so yeah, I still think this is cool enough, even with that specific gripe saying that. Um, there we go. Two. Uh, oh, but as always, please screw it around the village. Okay, I'm off. Uh, hopefully, I didn't screw that up. All right. Around the village would be good. Would be a good place to kind of put Scrooge stuff. Obviously in the plaza. Even though it's right next to it. Uh, how do I do this? I'm also still trying to get used to this specific... Yeah. There we go. Whoop. Ah, uh, this thing is also very... I hate this menu specifically. There we go. Uh, what? Okay. Oh, I should actually probably put it somewhere where it would point to his direction. Alright, let me rotate the item. Uh, There we go. Yeah, right here would be good. It tells you right here. It's Scrooge's shop. It's right there. Okay. Uh, This would also be good, I'd say. Yeah, this way to Scrooge's place. Alright. Now, obviously, we need to put it on the other side of the direction, because maybe someone's coming in from, like, over there. Yeah. Aw, oh, man. What, 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 what was going on here? Why are you making my life difficult on purpose? Alright. Obviously, this beautiful- Mickey needs to see the fact that Scrooge's shop is right there. <laughs> Alright, this is the last one. Uh, we need to go far away. We need to get his reach from everywhere. Right here. Ah, uh, do 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 do. 
Let me see, is it pointing the right way? It is sure not pointing the right way. There we go. Just keep going that direction. Eventually, you will reach Scrooge's shop. I swear to you. Alright. Hello, Goofy. Let's go in here. But yeah, as I'm kind of playing through it and still kind of going through it, I think I'll play mess around with this a little bit more. Um, because I really like the Disney stuff, to be honest. Get a little song hanging in your house. Thank you. Ooh. Ah. Cool, now I can hang up a sweet Scrooge McDuck shop. A wee bit of polish, just enough to say. We have everything uh -huh. you need. It's a bit modest, isn't it? <laughs> Maybe just a ticket. Too much extravagance to scare the folks of the village away. Dude, there's like two dudes who live here. You guys all have to basically get everyone to come back here. Like, for example, Remy used to live here, but he's not here right now. So I have to eventually do something to get Remy back, and then I assume he'll be able to put stuff. Gather the following items. I think I have a dandelion and the other stuff. I just need to go pick them up. But yeah. This game. I think it's neat. It's got a cool direction. Here's the other stuff in here. So yeah, you can also collect memories. Here's a sweet picture of Mickey and Remy hanging out together. And the Beast and Vanellope for some reason hanging out, which feels weird. I don't know how I feel about that. Eve is pissed at Remy hanging out with Mickey. Not a fan. Not a fan of the cross rat v mouse pollination going on here. Uh, this is also the beginning step here. Merlin here was the first character you meet. And he kind of puts you through stuff. As you can see here, there's also a bunch of shit. There's just a shitload of stuff going on here. Just a fuck ton of stuff, and it goes in real time too. So, there's also a bunch of different outfits, as you can see here. The Scrooge McDuck store top, a fishing hat, which is what I have. You also have for various items, such as sword in the stone. There's apparently only one sword in the stone item, so I assume that's the the sword in the stone that you can get on your back or something. But you get stuff from Wally, -E, Moana, Ratatouille, Beauty and the Beast, Wreck It Ralph, Cinderella, The Lion King. The Little Mermaid, Frozen, Tangled, Monsters, Inc., Incredibles, Cocos, Cars. And then there's also non-Disney related stuff that I guess you can wear too. That I don't think I've figured out how to wear that stuff. Wish there was a slower way to go. Maybe if I go through here. Yeah, there we go. Tangled, Monster Toy Story, Lilo and Stitch, The Incredibles, Coco, stuff like that. Yeah, here's all your quest stuff. To unlock more, you have to advance your friendship to get more quests. So, I'm currently my Mickey and my Donald, my God. Uh, Goofy and my Mickey are level 2. Merlin's still not level 2. He asked me to go do something a while ago, but I've kind of been ignoring him. Because Mickey and Goofy needed my help and Scrooge too, and I went with them. There's also this stuff where you can kind of just like... I don't know, do stuff? There's actually... I've, I've been curious on this. Let me go over here. So if I go in here, check... There we go. Yeah, it's... It, again, this is weird. Some of this stuff... I'm not a hundred. What the hell did I just unleash in the world? Hello, friend. Oh, it's a little crocodile friend. Hello. I guess he hangs out here now. Uh, but you can go here and then I think unlock premium. I don't know what that means. Activate the premium and start to collect tokens faster and unlock even more exclusive rewards. I guess I'll just use. Yeah, it's weird. I think this is the paid currency stuff. <clears throat> Don't know how I feel about this, but... Hmm. I'll probably save it because they give me a whole bunch. I could probably save it for later. Oh, you can unlock a bunch of, like, Incredibles, some Moonstones. I guess this is their equivalent of a Battle Pass. Huh. Interesting. I mean, there's no re... Oh, well, if I... I'll see how I... Hmm. 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 Ooh, you can get a guitar from Moana. Yeah, I'm not sure about this kind of stuff. I don't think there's anything you need to buy right now, but the game's also in early access. And based off of what I had to deal with Marvel Snap when it came to um, uh, specifically Disney property stuff, because Marvel's also Disney, mm, it, I expect this to maybe be a little bit rough when it actually launches, but it isn't right now. So let me see if I can just, there we go, confirm activation. See what happens. Okay, so I get even more stuff now. This will help me. Yeah, that's weird. This is just like the Fortnite thing. That's that's bizarre. Well, the Incredible Squirrel. <laughs> Who wouldn't want that? Well, anyway. Hmm, currency. Yeah, and then you just kind of do stuff and you can unlock it. It shouldn't be too hard if I just play the damn game. 
Yeah, so this is the game so far. I like it. I've been enjoying my time with it. I'll probably keep playing more, especially because it's around Halloween time, so that can only mean one thing. Uh, Haunted Mansion stuff. So I very much at least want to see what that kind of brings to the game, and we'll see how where it goes from here. But that's the end of the video, everyone. Thank you very much for watching. If you watched it, you can leave a like and stuff like that. If you're interested in this, let me know. <laughs> I'll probably keep messing around and still keep playing it. I think this is cool in concept. I also wish there was a little bit more customization things. I could not control the full bust and waist size of my character. If I could, I would have made her extremely buff. But I did my best with what I got. She's got Harley Quinn hair that you can't see because of the fishing hat that, gave, that Goofy gave me. But that's the end of the video, everyone. Thank you very much for watching. Until next time, I'll see you guys later. Peace out.